glaucoma, a debilitating eye condition and one of the most common causes of blindness. But did you know the important role that your heartbeat plays in preventing glaucoma? Well, until recently, neither did science. Medical researchers in Japan have observed evidence that may change our understanding of the link between our heartbeat and our eye health. You see, a healthy eye relies on a balanced flow of a fluid called aqueous humor within the eye. But blockage of the eye's drainage channels causes an increase in pressure on the optic nerve, resulting in blindness. So, the targets of glaucoma treatments are to restore proper flow of fluid and reduce the pressure in the eye. So, what's the discovery? Well, during the routine laser eye surgery of a glaucoma patient, the surgeons noticed an unintended fibrin flap had formed near the patient's implanted drainage channel called a shunt. What was remarkable was that the flap was moving in sync with the patient's heartbeat, acting as a metronome and showing the flow of fluid within the eye. The amount of aqueous humor that flows out of the eye represents only approximately 1% of the content of the anterior chamber. So this chance observation has provided clear proof of what researchers had previously speculated about. For example, previous research has noted that the pulsatile flow of aqueous humor into the aqueous veins is cyclic and synchronous with the ocular pulse waves that originate in Schlem's canal. Or one hypothesis was that the ocular pulse waves are induced by the change in the choroidal vascular volume, as the cardiac pulse oscillates between diastole and systole, acting as a piston for an aqueous pump. Indeed, the ocular pulse can induce pulsatile motion of the trabecular meshwork outward into Schlem's canal, causing a decrease in total volume in Schlem's canal lumen and a transient increase in Schlem's canal pressure. This allows the intraocular pressure increase to elicit a pulse wave expelling aqueous humor from Schlem's canal. This idea was recently supported by work showing the pulse-dependent motion of the trabecular meshwork using phase-sensitive optical coherence tomography. In this recent observation of the patient with the Bayervelt tube, the fibrin flap mimicked the behavior of a cardiac valve, and the aqueous humor with stray fibrin particles mimicked the blood in the chambers of the heart. Although the Bayervelt tube itself is an artificial instrument not present in normal human eyes, this observation shows the fundamental mechanism of aqueous humor drainage. The result is an improved understanding of the role of the heartbeat in regulating the flow of fluid within the eye. In addition to proposed mechanisms such as decreased norepinephrine levels, a rise in colloid osmotic pressure, hypocapnia, a rise in blood lactate, and a link to body weight, this regulation of fluid movement in the eye may partly explain why exercise is helpful in preventing glaucoma. This is a small observation, but could have big implications for how we prevent and treat glaucoma in the future.